All right, makeup geeks, I'm gonna give you everything that you need to know about cream blushes. I know a lot of you are kind of scared to use this because you're not sure how to apply it, which ones are great. So I'm gonna give you everything that you need to know about cream blushes, so let's get started. So let's start off first on who cream blushes is best for. Number one, if you have a dry skin, cream blushes is amazing because if you use a powder blush on top of your dry skin, that dry powder can almost enhance your dryness and um, just make your cheeks look very dull. But if you use something like a cream blush that's very creamy, very moisturizing, it can add that nice youthful glow to your skin. Also, if you have aging skin, as we age, we tend to get drier. So using something, again, that's creamy, it kind of just gives you that youthful look to your face and it just adds a nice dewiness to your skin that we tend to lose as we get older and then lastly those who live in colder climates or during the colder months it's great to use a cream blush because um, again it kind of um, sits on the face and just adds moisture in that that coldness tends to take out and also if you live in um, warmer climates or where it's humid using a cream product sometimes can slide it can melt or can make you look even more oily so it's best to use it during the cold times or if you live in a cold climate so anyways let's Let's go on to my favorite cream blushes. So I have three different cream blushes that I wanted to show you guys. They're my absolute favorites, really nice products. The first one is the Stila Convertible. Now this you can use on the cheeks, but also the lips. So it's a dual purpose product. You can use it wherever you like. This is the color Peony and it's a beautiful warm pink color. They have several shades that will work for fair, medium, and dark skin. So that's a really nice product, highly pigmented, not sticky at all. Another one of my favorites is by Illa Masca. They make amazing blushes, both powder and cream. This color is Rude. I don't know why I call it Rude, but it's a really pretty peach color that looks great on everyone. It's the only true peach color I've found, so I really like Illa Masca's cream blushes. And then also, NYX makes some nice blushes, and this is really inexpensive. I think these run about 7 or $8. They have lots of colors. This is the color Rose Petal, and it's a very warm pink. And this one also, it isn't sticky, it doesn't look oily, and it comes in beautiful colors. So those are my three favorite blushes. Now I want to show you three tools on what how you can apply your cream blush. You can use a brush like this. It's a cheek uh, highlighter blush, cheek highlighter brush. It has um, very soft kind of flat bristles here on top, and you can apply it just stippling on, which I'll demonstrate in a second. Another tool you can use is a sponge. This is a beauty blender. You can pick up the product and apply it this way. It's not my favorite way to apply blush, but if anything, you can use this to. Uh, blend it into the skin. And then lastly, you can use your fingers, and that's my favorite because it's free. <laughs> you just dip it in and apply it. So let's go on to how to actually apply this cream blush. So on this cheek, I'm gonna show you how to apply the blush with your fingers, and that's my preferred method just because it's free and it's really easy. You're gonna take two of your middle fingers clean, <laughs> dip them into your blush. I'm gonna apply the Illa Masca one because it's one of my favorites. You're gonna pick up some of that product on your fingers, smile, and we're just going to apply this to the apples of the cheeks. Now when you first apply cream blush, it can look a little bit bright until you start tapping it and blending it in. Now if you feel it's still too bright after that, that's where your beauty blender or your sponge can come in. And you just pat this on top and it picks up some of that color to where it doesn't look so bright. So that's how you do it with your fingers. Let's go on to this side where I'm gonna show you how to use this cheek stippling brush. Take your brush and you're going to stipple it here into the blush until you pick up enough product. Now if you're afraid that you picked up too much, what you can do is tap it a couple times on the back of your hand to kind of take off some of the excess. And then apply it the same way on your cheek, just smile. And you're going to stipple this on. And the only reason I don't like using the brush is you see how it applies a little bit too much and that's where you need to go in with your beauty blender and kind of blend it out. So for me, it's just easier honestly to use your fingers and it's much quicker. But there's a couple different options for you guys on how to apply your blush. So I hope all this information was really helpful for you guys. Don't be afraid to use cream blushes. They're amazing. They really give you a nice finish to your skin. Just you have to know which ones to get and how to apply it, but it's super easy. So go to MakeupGeek.com. I have a complete list of my favorite blushes, um, product recommendations, reviews, all sorts of great stuff. So check that out. But I really hope you guys are doing great, and I will talk to you soon. Bye.